Is it time to buy or sell Canoe stock? Today, we're delving into Canoe, providing you with a more detailed analysis following our recent report. Stay tuned for valuable insights. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and enable notifications to stay informed about our latest analysis. Stay ahead of crucial updates that could impact your investments. Empower your trading decisions with our new AI stock analysis tool, powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Access free price predictions and in-depth analysis for over 25,000 companies worldwide. Please remember, this video is for informational purposes only and is not financial advice. Since March 11th, 2024, our system has identified Canoe as a buy candidate with a score of 1.60. Now let's delve into how the stock has performed during this period. Investors who heeded our analysis would have seen a notable gain of 18.66% since Canoe was first recommended as a buy candidate 19 days ago. This equates to an average daily return of 0.98% since it was designated as a buy candidate. The stock is currently positioned within a strong upward trend in the short term, indicating a potential for further growth. Based on the three-month trend, a significant 241.88% change is forecasted, with potential returns ranging from 98.68% to 688.0%. Looking ahead to the next 12 months, a 13.26% change is expected, with potential returns between minus 93.1% and 131.85%, translating to a price range of $4.7 to $4.94. In our latest update on Canoe, we saw a red day for Canoe Inc. as the stock price dropped by nigh 4.91% on Friday, April 5, 2024, from $2.24 to $2.30. This marks the fourth consecutive day of decline. On the last trading day, the stock price ranged from a low of 2 of to a high of 2.27, showing a fluctuation of 7.58%. The stock has experienced a decrease in price for 8 out of the last 10 days, resulting in an overall decline of minus 50.92% during this period. It's worth noting that the trading volume decreased by nat 2 million shares on the same day, aligning with the downward movement of the stock. A total of 4 million shares were traded, amounting to approximately $8.38 million. Looking back over the past 52 weeks, the stock's highest price was $4.81 while the lowest was Oratsis. Currently, the stock price is 55.71% lower than the 52-week high at 2.68 cents and 91.45% below the all-time high of 24.90 on December 22, 2020. Analyst Ratings On Tuesday, April 2, 2024, H.C. Wainwright rated Joe Eve as a buy with a hold recommendation. On Wednesday, November 15, 2023, E.F. Hutton also rated Joe E. as a buy with a hold recommendation. On Saturday, July 23, 2022, R.F. Lafferty gave a buy rating with a hold recommendation. Analysts have given Canoe stock a general sell rating. They rate the P.E. ratio as sell and price to book as sell. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a strong sell rating. Canoe Inc. stock signals, short-term moving average sell signal, long-term moving average buy signal. Overall, buy signal due to short-term average above long-term average, forecasting positive stock performance. Resistance at 290s, support at $1.64. Breakthrough short-term average buy signal. Breakdown long-term average sell signal. Negative signals present, influencing short-term outlook. Sell signal issued on March 21, 2024, with minus 50.92% decrease. Sell signal from 3-month MACD, volume decrease with price reduce overall risk. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, sell signal. Pivots, sell signal 11 days ago. Bollinger, buy signal 61 days ago. Short-term moving average, buy signal 6 days ago. Long-term moving average, buy signal 21 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, buy signal 21 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart, we see short moving average, sell signal 3 days ago. The long-term moving average, buy signal 21 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, buy signal 20 days ago. 
Remember to visit our page at stockinvest.us for more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for Canoe When it comes to support levels, Canoe's stock has key support areas at $194 and $1.80 based on accumulated volume. It's important to note that if the stock falls below $180, it could result in a significant drop in price due to lack of support. Canoe exhibits high volatility with the potential for large price swings throughout the day. The Bollinger Band indicates a wide prediction interval, signaling very high risk for this stock. In the past day, the stock moved 116th equivalent to 7.58% of its value. Over the last week, daily average volatility has been at 17.12%. Let's start by discussing the price to earnings ratio, PE ratio, for Canoe. This ratio compares the company's current share price to its per share earnings. A negative PE ratio indicates that the company is either losing money or has negative earnings. While downturns are common, persistent negative ratios could suggest financial challenges and potential bankruptcy risks. Moving on to upcoming events, Canoe's Q1 2024 earnings report is scheduled for May 20, 2024. Analysts are estimating earnings at $2.207 per share. These figures can significantly impact stock prices, so it's essential to monitor them closely. Now let's discuss potential day trading levels for Canoe. In an upward trend, the first resistance level for Canoe is at $2.24. If you do not own any shares, consider waiting for this level to be breached before entering a position. For current stockholders, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, Canoe faces its first support level at $1.94. If this support level holds, it might serve as a good entry point with potential for a rebound. The combined average rating for Canoe from multiple analyst sources is sell. Let's delve into some recent insider trades. On 2024's Euro 205, Diaz Debra conducted an insider buy of zero shares. On 2024 to 205, Chen James Chayan conducted an insider buy of zero shares. On 2024 to 207, Ruiz Hector M conducted an insider or sell of 745 shares of common stock. On 2024 or 124, Murthy Remesh conducted an insider sell of 1,217 shares of common stock. On 2023 to 1220, Etheridge Gregg conducted an insider buy of 1,500,000 shares of common stock. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be positive with a ratio of 87.715. Overall, insiders purchased 1,506,835 1 shares and sold 46,151,265 1 shares in the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $2 reflecting a decrease of 5.96%. This stock exhibits significant daily movements, translating to heightened risk. A sell signal was identified from a pivot top 10 days ago. Is Canoe stock a good buy? Based on several short-term signals and a positive overall trend, we believe there is a buying opportunity for Canoe Inc. stock with a fair chance of good performance in the short term. Our analysis indicates that the current price is undervalued after considering the volatility and movements from the last trading day. Looking ahead to trading on Monday, April 8th, we anticipate Canoe to open up at $2.07, showing a port and four-zero increase. It's important to remember that trading carries a high risk of financial loss. Before making any investment decisions, it is advisable to consult with a financial advisor. Please note that StockInvest.us should not be the sole basis for your investment choices. By utilizing this information, you acknowledge and accept responsibility for your own investment actions. Presenting our current analysis of the stock. Share your thoughts in the comments. Do you agree or disagree? What target do you have in mind for this stock? Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more updates. Wishing you successful trading and a wonderful day from all of us at Stock Invest.